Hey guys, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to install the Nordic GTK theme. So this is what it looks like. It's a pretty nice looking theme. It's a dark theme. And uh, obviously it's not using these icons, like you have to install the icons separately, but uh, it's a pretty nice theme, so let's get working. So to start off, you're gonna to need to install Git, and the instructions to install Git are right here. After you get Git installed, you can open up a terminal window and uh, you can copy the git clone command right here and it will download the theme to your system. From there, you can run ls nordic to make sure that everything is in there and we can see it is. From there, we can pick our type of installation. So you can do a single user installation, which means you'll be, you'll be able to get it for a single user, so you're yourself, or you can do a system-wide installation for everybody. So let's do a single user create the folder and then we can do just make sure uh, that the folder is there we can run ls-a and if we look for themes we see the folder is right there now from here we can move the Nordic folder into the themes folder and if I run the CD themes once again, we can see that it's there. And if we need to take a look at and see what's inside, we can run this command here and we can confirm, yes, it's there. So now it's installed, so we don't need this anymore. Close that. Now from here, we can go to our appearance settings. So I use XFCE because it's the most customizable and suitable for my needs, but uh, yours may differ, but so I'll show you how to turn it on in this. So let's go to the appearance settings and appearance settings is right here and we can look for Nordic and apply it. Now we're using the Nordic GTK theme. Now if you're using XFCE you will also need to go to the window manager theme and change this over to Nordic so you're using its uh, theme as well, the folder theme, the window manager theme, excuse me. But this is Nordic and uh, you can also change the icons if you want them to match the green like in the screenshot. But this is how you get the Nordic GTK theme working on Linux. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.